When we make something as a lineal with no fabrication, we just sell by the foot. Yeah. But when we do a fabricated part, we're going to do a rolled up cost, including tooling and cost of production, even with uh, the R&D piece covered. Hi, I'm Pamela with a COA division of Bonnell Aluminum and we make aluminum extrusions. We have two different divisions and uh, the extrusion division makes lineal shapes for building and construction, automotive, uh, OEM type equipment, consumer durables. We also have a division, a COA and Future Industries of Bonnell Aluminum where we manufacture pieces and parts by putting in cutting, punching, drilling, deburring, uh, and different type of fabricated steps so that we can deliver a fully finished fabricated part to our customers. They can put it right into assembly. We might punch a hole or drill a hole for people to put screw bosses in. Um, we might put a different backside piece of machining on it so that they can get another type of fitting or fastener down in there. We have finishes that we put on parts. I mean, everybody knows aluminum is this color, but what if you needed something in this color? So we do anodizing and painting. We can extrude sizes from 1 to 16 inches and weights up to 20 pounds a foot. This one has an anodized finish of a dark bronze, and uh, we do anodized finishes in all of our plants, including paint. This would be a piece or a finished part to a customer. But we'd extrude it in a 20 or 24 foot length. We'd cut it to length, and then we'd impart all the machining on it so we could deliver a finished part to the customer. So this is a piece of medical equipment, and it's a boom for an operating room. So if you go in to see your doctor and some piece of equipment swings out over you, this would be the thing that holds it up. If it was just a hollow, it wouldn't be as strong, but it is for strength of the part. That would be something our design team would typically suggest. So if we see improvements for parts, Bonnell's the type manufacturer and ACO and uh, uh, Futura are type manufacturers as well that would enhance the customer's part by sharing what we know. So there's a part that has a little of everything. Not only would we extrude the part and, and put the finishing on it, but we would notch these holes out, drill these holes here, and ultimately add to the customer's um, usable piece of the puzzle when they get this from us. So they go right to production or assembly. Casting and uh, an extrusion are two totally different uses for aluminum. Um, while there's a lot of desirables in casting, the strength in a fully wrought piece of extruded aluminum that's been annealed and, and stress relieved is just a completely different product. So this would be a, a design element a customer would need for strength and durability. It'd be a near net shape and so we're taking a lot of the cost out. I mean, imagine if someone bought a solid piece of aluminum and had to end up with a design like this. So we can impart all the uh, attributes of a near net shape and get somebody right to the end of their process. 6000 series aluminum is our specialty. It would be the, the type of aluminum used for building and construction, OEM, uh, consumer durables. We also have a fully capable automotive division specializing in automotive alloys as well. The longest we can go in anodizing is 32 foot. The longest we can go in paint is 24 foot. Most of our people have been with the company approaching 30, 40 years of service with Bunnell. And I really think people is what makes the difference. Um, Bunnell's the type company you want to talk to and you want to have uh, involved in your business. We frequently are, are helping find cost savings and different initiatives we share with customers. Give us a call for aluminum extrusions or fabricated parts from aluminum extrusions. We'll be glad to help. See us and other quality suppliers at d2p.com.